the 10 News Weather Authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. Hi there, friends. I'm meteorologist Jeff Hanowich. A couple of showers possible up into Highland and Bath counties here over the next couple of hours or so. Bulk of the rain still staying west of us, but what's west, what's west is moving east. And yes, we are going to have a better chance for rain here with this front pushing through here come tomorrow. Scattered showers and thunderstorms will be the name of the game for us from the late morning hours on. This front is eventually going to cool us down as well. So again, a few showers possible from now through about maybe 3 a.m. Then we get a break. Tomorrow is a day where we want clouds all day. All right, we've said this for a couple of days now. We don't want much sunshine tomorrow. You're probably saying, Hanowitz, you're out of your mind. Why? Well, the more sun we see, the more the air destabilizes. We want that air as stable as possible when this front pushes through here in the afternoon and evening hours. Notice that we're going to have a better chance for some rain and embedded thunderstorms as soon as 11 a.m. tomorrow, such that by noon, 1 o'clock tomorrow, we will have some scattered showers and thunderstorms around. So if you're planning to eat your lunch outdoors tomorrow, have your local weather authorities app in the palm of your hand so you can check out the radar and see if it's a good idea or not. Probably a good idea to keep it inside tomorrow. Take it outside here next week. Next week looks to be much prettier. We may actually get a small little break from the rain in some of our backyards as we head say closer to dinner time tomorrow, but we're not done. We have more rain and a couple of embedded thunderstorms perhaps pushing in later tomorrow evening, especially in the south side locations. Then we get another break, but we're still not done. This front could stall uh, just to the south of us across the Carolinas, and what that's going to do is provide us a continued chance for rain showers, especially in areas along and south of Highway 460 as we head into Friday and potentially even as we head into Saturday. It's going to be wetter Friday and Saturday in the NRV and south side than it will be up towards the highlands. Let's talk about how much rain we see here through Saturday. I would say a tenth of an inch to a half an inch of rain, a good bet. There will be isolated spots that get maybe closer to three quarters of an inch of rain, but for the most part, a tenth of an inch to half an inch of rain headed our way. Let's talk about Easter. Uh, you need to know that we're going to be cooler with a wedge in play Friday and Saturday, but that wedge breaks on Sunday. Sunday will be a nicer day to be outside. Sunrise service on Easter Sunday a little bit before 7 a.m., about 6.53 in the morning. And at that point, we're going to have temperatures close to 40, so a coat will be needed. However, after church, for those Easter egg hunts, we're in the middle 50s with a little more sunshine to enjoy. Temperatures then top out in the low to mid 60s on Easter Sunday. It's been breezy, arguably windy outside for us today. And right now we have winds about 5 to 15 miles per hour. And those winds are actually uh, not going to be a huge deal for us tomorrow unless you're under a thunderstorm. If you're under a thunderstorm tomorrow, the winds are going to be quite gusty. 40, 50 mile per hour gusts possible in any thunderstorm that forms during the heating of the day tomorrow. But if you're storm free, the wind shouldn't play a huge role in your forecast. Right now it's 66 in Hot Springs, 72 in uh, Lynchburg, 73 Martinsville. It's 68 in Hillsville and Galax. Jetstream is going to take a dip, allowing us to be on the cooler side as we head into Friday and Saturday. But the thing is, the warmth's not that far away from us when the wedge is here, such that the warmth returns for us as we head into the early part of the next work week for tonight. A few mountain showers possible. Very warm overnight lows in the 60s. That's about where we should be for daytime highs. Scattered showers, thunderstorms develop for tomorrow. Highs in the 70s and 80s and in your extended forecast. Temperatures are mainly in the 50s Friday, Saturday, 60s Sunday, Monday, well up into the 70s Tuesday, Wednesday, Easter Sunday's dry. Early next week looks really pretty too. Today we forecast 83. The actual high was 85. $10 in the pot, $140 raised so far for the Blacksburg Refugee Partnership.